baby boomer, aka boomer for short, is a person born between the years 1946 to 1964. The term baby boom refers to the noticeable increase of birth rates after World War II. In North America and Western Europe, baby boomers are widely associated with privilege. Boomers represent nearly 20% of the American public today. Why am I telling you this? Because we need an intro. Today, we are taking all the boomers from the NBA and putting them together on a wheel. We will spin this wheel 13 times to get 13 players to make the ultimate team of boomers. Folks, I bring to you the Wheel of Boomers. Okay, and just before we start the video, I'd like to give a quick shout out to today's sponsor, Raycon. The guys at Raycon sent me their wireless earbuds earlier in the year and I've been using them ever since. I'm still amazed how good the quality is. If you don't already know, Raycon is a brand that was started by Ray J and celebrities like my main man J.R. Smith are already obsessed. These are the E25s and they're a true wireless earphone. Because of the way they're shaped, you can hardly even tell they're there. The ones I got are blue, but Raycon offers a whole wide range of colors and patterns to choose from. And these go for half the price of any other premium wireless earbud on the market. These things are so comfortable that sometimes I forget I even have them in my ear. It's kind of awkward getting in the shower with them. Raycon is also running a Black Friday and Cyber Monday deal. A deal so good that I can't even tell you what it is. Go to buyraycon.com forward slash Troyden and check out this amazing Black Friday deal for yourself. And again, thanks to Raycon for sponsoring this video. That's right, guys. Today, we're going to be spinning the Wheel of Boomers. And as you can see, there are so many that they don't even really fit. I have put every single boomer that is available in my team and not dead, because that would be disrespectful, on this wheel. We have living and breathing baby boomers. Now, there has been a lot of talk about age discrimination going on on the internet and people saying the hot new insult, okay, boomer. You know, there's a lot of great NBA players that were boomers. That's right, also some terrible ones. But I'm confident today that this wheel can provide me a team to win. That's right, it is time now for our first spin. Three, two, one, okay, boomer. We're gonna say that every time. Damn, two, now. Come on, we got, I can't even tell what we got because I can't see. The names are so many. It's R Rolando Blackman. Wait, that's a real person? I thought that was a Jimmy Blackman joke. Born February the 26th, 1959, Rolando Blackman was the ninth overall pick in the 1981 draft. He is a four-time NBA All-Star. And that's about it. We have a 96 overall pink diamond that can play two positions. When he, what has he done? He's, he made the All-Star team in the 80s. Big whoop. He's got no rings, no credentials. Other than that, this is the definition of boomer privilege. I'm starting to understand why everyone's so mad at boomers. I just saw it firsthand. Three, two, one. Okay, boomer. Sorry to spit on the mic. That's quite frequently. We got, uh, I don't know what we got. We have, oh, Rudy Tomjanovic. Nailed it. Born November 24th, 1948, Rudy was drafted into the NBA second overall in the first round in 1970. He would go on to be a five-time NBA All-Star, but he's probably more well-known for being punched in the face in the late 70s. We have a 92 overall amethyst, Rudy Tomjanovic. I, it looks right to me, okay? Rudy, you got two rings. You got him as a coach, though, so I'm not too sure why being punched in the face means you get a 92 overall. I'm just saying, these boomers, these boomers. I think the millennials are the best generation of our generation. That's right, three, two, one, okay, boomer. Come on, baby, give me a boomer that can make the ball go in the net better than anyone else. That's what we're looking for. It's basketball. 
Uh, world be free. Isn't this the guy with the messed up hairline? World be free, AKA Lloyd Bernard Free, was born December 9th, 1953. He was drafted in 1975, 23rd overall in the second round. He would go on to be selected for just one NBA All-Star game. We got 91 overall. Amethyst World be free. Can you? S this is insane. I never realized how bad boomers are until this. Until this just happened. He has no credentials at all. He got selected to an NBA All-Star game, and that's it. And was probably a cast of boomers as well, supporting other boomers. This is so stupid. Look at his hair. It's worse than mine. I went into this having no issue with boomers. In fact, my parents are boomers, but that's completely changed as I have just seen it with my own two eyes. Unreal. Three, two, one. Okay, Boomer. Give me someone that deserves to be here. A Boomer that actually deserves the card they were given. Like Rick Mahorn. Born September 21st, 1958, Rick was the 35th overall pick in the second round in 1980. He played for six different teams and has won two WNBA championships. Wait, what? Oh, he was a coach. He was a WNBA coach. That makes a lot more sense. 79 overall, Rick Mahorn out here. Uh, I mean, okay, you know what? A gold card I think is very fitting for Rick. Though it is impressive that he has won two WNBA championships. He also won an NBA championship as well. But the two WNBA, that's cool. Rick is deserving. He won an NBA championship and a WNBA. Can any other player say that? Maybe Kelly Ombre. I think she could pass. Three, two, one. Okay, Boomer. Give me a Boomer that I want. Give me Air Boomer. Can you, can you, get, tell me, you know what I want. You know what I want, what I need. It's... Who the Flintstone fart is Brian Winters? Born March the 1st, 1952, Brian was selected 12th overall in the 1974 draft by the Los Angeles Lakers. He would go on to be selected for two NBA All-Star games. And that is it. 89 overall, Ruby Brian Winters. Two NBA All-Star games. And this isn't even his best card. This guy has two cards in the game. This is a reward card that I don't have because I don't want to waste my tokens on someone that has only made the All-Star game twice. I can't believe this. I had no idea how much Boomer privilege is going on in this game. It makes me sick. Boomers. One, two, three. Okay, Boomer. Give me someone that deserves, that should be, that is Jesus of the Boomers, Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones was born December 18th, 1951, and was drafted into the NBA in 1974, fifth overall by the Houston Rockets. Bobby is an NBA champion, a four-time NBA All-Star, an eight-time defensive first team, and a sixth man of the year, plus some other accolades as well. That's right, he actually earned his spot. Amethyst 90, Bobby Jones. I'm so glad that Bobby is a real worker while well, he have other boomers out here not pulling their share. There's also a diamond version of this card, but I don't have it. Three to one, okay, boomer. You don't have to say three to one. You have to say okay, boomer. Come on, give me yellow. Is that yellow? Yellow. Larry Nance. Larry Nance was born February the 12th, 1959, and was chosen 20th overall in the first round in 1981. He would become a three-time NBA All-Star, an NBA All-Defensive First Team, and an NBA Slam Dunk Contest Champion. We got Diamond 94 overall, Larry Nance joining us today. You know, a diamond for Larry Nance? That's pretty good, because even though his credentials might not equal a diamond, he had good seed, okay? Very good seed. It's now doing very well in the NBA. I just refer to Larry Nance Jr. as seed. I'm not sure what kind of team we got so far, but I can tell you, it's privilege. Three to one, okay, Boomer. Come on, give me someone that played in the 80s. was really good in the 90s, very good. You could say he's one of the best. Adrian Daintley. 
Born February the 28th, 1956, Adrian was selected sixth overall in 1976 by the Buffalo Braves. I swear that was a real team. He's a six-time NBA All-Star, a two-time NBA scoring champion, and also a Rookie of the Year. Might I add who is Mr. Basketball USA in 1973, 89 overall, Adrian Daintly out here today. Yes, he does have a slightly better card, and no, I don't have it, so we're going to use the ruby. But you know what? I am happy a deserving boomer is here. This guy has credentials. This guy deserves. He deserves to have an actual card in this game. We don't even have Taco Fall in the game. And there's bum-ass boomers out here taking the space. I'm pissed. You know what we need? We need a boomer center. And we need one now because I'm getting worried. Three, two, one. Okay, boomer. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if it's insulting, boomers, but it's fun to say, so suck it. We got air conditioner green. Born October 4th, 1963, AC Green was selected 23rd overall in 1985 by the Los Angeles Lakers. He would become a three-time NBA champion and selected to the All-Star team in 1990. We have a 91 overall amethyst air conditioner green. That's right, he can play two positions and yeah, this card's deserving. Okay, he might not have been the leading scorer for those three NBA championships, but he was there and being there counts. Ask Brian Scalabrini. All right, we're making some progress, though I'm very, very spooked and worried and concerned about the team that's being assembled in front of my eyes. Sweet Lord Jesus. Okay, Boomer. Please, Lord, Boomers, come on, Boomers, be great. Boom, Lord, my team with skill and talent, and Boomer! Born February 17th, 1963, Michael Jordan was drafted into the NBA as the biggest steal in the history of basketball. Third overall by the Chicago Bulls. He would become a six-time NBA champion, a six-time finals MVP, a five-time regular season MVP, a 14-time NBA All-Star, a 10-time NBA First Team, nine-time defensive team. Just shut up! 91 overall, Michael Jordan. I forgot we don't have a better Michael yet. Gee, this is tits on ice. We should have a Galaxy Opal Macal Jordan at the beginning of every year. Even though this card is only a 91, it's still amazing. It's still the GOAT. It's still his airness. We got the king of all boomers. And in fact, not just the king of boomers. He's the king of all players. The greatest to do it. Three, two, one. Okay, Boomer. We do need some centers, though. We're going to be screwed without centers. We need some bigs. Please. In fact, give me a big right now. Oh, I swear. Hakeem! Born January the 21st, 1963, this seven-foot Nigerian was drafted number one overall in 1984 by the Houston Rockets. He's a two-time NBA champion, a two-time NBA Finals MVP, a regular season MVP, a 12-time NBA All-Star, a D... You know what? This guy's got a ton of credentials, just like Jordan. 92 overall, Hakeem Elijah Wan. Ah, one of the greatest centers of all time. Some people put him number one, not me, but he's in the top three. He definitely is. He's a very good boomer, and I'm glad he's here. I was worried we weren't gonna have a big, but I am not worried now. No longer my worries exist. They're gone. Three, two, one. Okay, boomer. Please finish me off right. I want to be finished good today. Finish me with a boomer that knows what they're doing. Like Alvin Adams. Just kidding. I have no idea who this is. Alvin Adams was born July 19, 1954, and was drafted into the NBA in 1975, fourth overall by the Phoenix Suns. He won the 1976 Rookie of the Year and never did a single thing after that. 89 overall Ruby, Alvin Adams. Why? Well, why does this guy have a car? Who did he do? I want to know. Did he obviously did something non-basketball related to get a Ruby card. I mean, he did win Rookie of the Year, but he did nothing after that. Absolutely nothing. Adams. And it is now time for our final spin. We've got some boomers out here. 
some boomers indeed. A couple of good ones, though, so I won't complain. Three, two, one. Okay, boomer. That'll be the last time I get to say okay, boomer, at least while spinning a wheel. That'll be the last time I say okay, boomer, I'll say that a lot. We got uh, James Slash. James Slash was born February 11th, 1949, and was drafted 70th overall in the fifth round in 1972 by the Houston Rockets. He is a two-time ABA All-Star, and that is absolutely it. Abs 92 overall, James Slash. Definition of boomer right here. This guy's done nothing. He's done abs. How did he get his goddamn number retired by the Spurs? It says here he had number 13 retired by the Spurs. Why? Because he's a boomer? He's done nothing! And this is the team that the Wheel of Boomers drafted. Point guard. We got World Be Free there. Goddamn, look at his head. What's going on? Shooting guard. You already knew he was going to be here. His airness, Michael Jardy. We got small forward, the only pink diamond on the team. Rolando Blackman. Okay, power forward. That's Larry Nance's spot. And our starting center is definitely Hakeem Elijah Wan. This team, this team, it's a weird bag of nuts, okay? It's like that trail mix where you got the good stuff you want, but then the stuff you never heard of, like those little peas, like wasabi peas, who puts those in there? And it is now time to go online to play a random. I haven't played in a minute, more like a week, and you know, I'll be fine. We have an experienced team in Boomers, so if anything goes wrong, we'll blame the younger generation. Yes, and here we go. Go! We're up against... Is that Gilbert Arenas? Tracy McGrady? Why does he want to show his team? Something very peculiar about a man that doesn't want to show his team. Maybe it's not a man. Maybe it's an ostrich. I don't know. Looking like it to me. What the hell is wrong with you? Jesus Christ! What do you want, a nightclub? Ah, oh, we are playing a snake team, as we see here. I don't know if this guy... I don't know what where, what the hell's going on with this guy. Listen to some sort of SoundCloud rapper in the background. I don't care. It does not matter. I forgot to change my jersey. Never gonna remember. Let's win the tip off, Akeem, and let's send this snake packing. Come on, boomers! Oh, I lost... That was a bad sign. All right, we got some defense, I think. We got some offense, I hope, and... Stainless, that's not going in, not going in. Wait, was his release green before he shot it? I'm confused. Here we go, give it a world be free. Your name is confusing. Ooh, ankles, ankles. I didn't know this guy could dribble. I didn't know this guy could. I didn't know world be free was good at all. Oh boy, it's gonna be one of these games, isn't it? All right, we are down by five early start, bad start. Ooh, ooh, Michael, 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 ooh, look at Michael dancing. He's prancing. He can shoot threes, but he's not gonna because that's not his talent. In there to Hakeem, didn't want to shoot that as fast as I did. And now I'm questioning why this game exists. Michael, Macau, Macau, Macau. There's that Jordan that I know. Give me that Michael Iso. Let him know. Let him know, Michael. Let him know. Oh, let him know. Take it. Take it. How am I not taking it? Let's go. Thank you. Come steal. Again. Let's go. We'll be free. He can shoot the three. I don't want to find out, though, if he can or not. Ooh, that's a bad pass. Faking it. Why are you jumping? Why are you not jumping? Why is the sky blue? Moves. Look at these. Inside. To Adams. Wait. Who's Adams? I know I drafted him, but I forgot. Come on. Jump. Wait, you going to leave him open? You're going to leave him open? You're going to leave him open? Don't leave Dately open. Because he can't shoot threes. Why am I shooting with him? Down by three. Start of the second. Let's do better, boomers. Let's do it. Salas. Oh, Salas. Salas. That's my boy. Salas is my man. Whatever his... What was his first name? Jonas. Get this rebound. Get this. We did. We did, boys. Right there, air conditioner. Air conditioner, brain. Air conditioner. Air, air conditioner. Ha, <laughs> ha. We're up. Salas. Salas going. He's too fast. Salas. That boomer can boom out. World be free. Can you hit the shot for me? I know you can't. Michael. 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 Let's go, Hakeem. Let's go. Hakeem, the drill. Oh, Hakeem. Hakeem. Right there to Michael. Pass it quarter. I should have shot it. Larry Nance. Larry Nance. Going to the dance. Save the last dance for Larry Nance. Larry. <laughs> oh, Lord. That's a Come on. Look at Hakeem. You can't do that to Hakeem. This boomer's been around. Go. Go right there. Good pass. Larry Nance. Why'd he stop? I don't understand this video game. Why did he stop? 
That's, you can tell right now this man's a virgin. No one has a name called Ladies Loves Mike. That means no one loves you. That means no ladies love you, in fact. That means you have to let people know that ladies love you because no one will believe it. Damn it. We got the bench out here. Probably not the ones to do it. Come. Salas, though. Dude, Salas is the main. I'm giving Salas an A grade today. What the hell did I just see? What is going on with this team? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to put the starters in for the rest of the game. I, 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 I'm good. One more shot. One more shot for this bench team. This bench team is costing me everything. Costing me everything, boomers. This guy's just doing alley oop after alley oop. I'm. Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's go. We'll be free all the way. Oh, we need some help, boomers. Boom up, baby. Oh my God, with a beat up for late. Sweet. Please don't go. In. What am I looking at? I, God damn it. I, Michael, 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 please, please, please. Michael, Michael. Come on, boys. We ain't going out. We are down by three going into the fourth quarter. Not playing good. We have not. I blame the boomers. I blame this team. I actually blame the game. I blame everything. I am a boomer. Defense, defense, defense. We need the D. We can get this done if we get some D on our side. Can we get some D on our side? Everyone just jump, jump. How does he get a foul wall? There's no foul wall there. Come on, boys, let's do this. Let's do this. One last shot. One last, right there. Ronaldo. Ronaldo Blackman. Yes! One point. Let's go. Come on, take it. Thank we you. Come on, again. Come on, Blackman. Oh, my one. Boom, boom up. Post him up. Post him. That's Anthony Davis. He's going to be hard to post up. Or is he? <laughs> Come on, Jonas. 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 Passing. Oh, my God. Did you see that move? No boomer can do that. That must be old Gen Y in a boomer costume. Thank you. Yoink, I got an unlock. I got a lucky yoink. Pass it. Pass it. Pass it. <laughs> what? What just? You got to be kidding me. Oh, you know what? I didn't deserve that. Did someone defend him. I didn't deserve that to go in. Come on. He doesn't deserve to get any to go in. That's not going in. That's definitely not going on. No way. No way. Let's keep this going. Ronaldo. 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 Has it to Michael. Michael. I'm feeling great. We got a seven-point lead. One Thank stop, there it is. That could be the one stop right there. That could be the one stop to win us the game. Hold it, black man. Hold it for a minute because we ain't in no rush today. We're boomers. We take our time. That's right. We're going to leave Michael open. You're going to leave Michael open. You got lucky. No. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're up by seven. We just have to get some stops. No threes. No threes. No threes. No threes. I don't think we're going to let this man have a three. I don't even think he's... What is he doing? No way. He, you have that two. That two's for free. That two's on sale. You can't even go get a free two out here. Cuh. And with time winding down, we're going to be fine. We're absolutely fine. Right there. Going up the floor. Why not? Right to Ronaldo. Big three for goes. Unnecessary. That was unnecessary. Just like Boomer's still in the workplace. Retire already. Okay? Just saying. We got the... Ow! Got the win today. This guy's mic was on. I don't know what he thought coming in. Playing the old boober team. He should have just quit. Doesn't he know? Experience over good play. Michael Jordan was my top scorer today. No surprise. Him going 8 for 15. No little surprise there. So maybe James Salas. That's a surprise being my best player. 18 points, 2 boards, 4 assists on 7 for 8 shooting. Not too bad. We got Rolando Blackman out here, 12 points. He did his job. Air conditioner green, he didn't do so well. And world be free. I don't know what's going on with your head. We shot better than him from the field goal. 58% to his 51. And I guess we shot better from three. 40% to his 23. Whew. He had no offensive rebounds that game. Two to eight. And he also beat me on defensive, 21 to 19. We did have nine steals, though. Only seven turnovers to his 11. And we got the win. That's the only thing that matters. A win is the only thing that matters at life. You hear that, boomers? Okay. Guys, thank you for watching. And as always, keep your stick on the ice.